Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I found a makeup brush cleaner at the Dollar Tree, you guys, and I wanted to review it for you guys. I've already used it. It's um, by the beauty section, you know where the makeup is, of course, and it's a brush cleaner. They had purple, a very nice deep purple. They had a, like a green, like a neon green, and then they had this. Um, I'm pretty sure at your local Dollar Tree they have other colors or whatnot. Just check the beauty section and um, check both beauty sections. Check by the medicine too and check by the makeup. Um, check everywhere. Um, if you really want one, sometimes people just throw them anywhere. So just check for them. Just look around. Keep your eyes open. So this uh, brush cleaner I want to say it's about two and a half, three inches, and it's just perfect for somebody that doesn't um, have a lot of makeup brushes, uh, doesn't use makeup like that, you know? I mean, I have a eyeshadow brush. I have brushes like this. You guys, I'm good to go. I use bronzer. I use um, eyeshadow and... I'm good to go. I don't use makeup like that. So the um, brush cleaners that I've seen out there, they're too big for somebody that doesn't use makeup like that, that doesn't have brushes like that. I have quite a few brushes and this is, this is enough. This is enough for me. And it's sturdy rubber, or I'm just going to call it rubber because I don't know what this is. And it's sturdy, you guys. I felt name brand expensive brush cleaners and it's the same uh texture same consistency uh same feel it feels really nice and i cleaned my makeup brushes you guys and it does the job it really does the job the grooves are deep see that they're very deep okay then you have your dots right here this this you guys it worked really really good if i stumble upon more i'm gonna get a few more the only thing i don't like about it you guys i don't know what that is but that okay is this cubby thing here i don't know what that is but be careful you don't i mean if you get water in there make sure you guys dry it out and get a paper towel and go in there because if you don't it's gonna mold eventually uh you're gonna get some mold or mildew growing in there from water so hang it set it down on a towel when you're done with it clean it and set it down on a towel like this okay let all that water drain out take a towel or a paper towel and get in there okay you don't want no mold or mildew and then you're putting these makeup brushes on your face and you're touching that and I know why they put it in there so you could put your hands in there like that I just don't like that. I'd rather have had a flat one. And you could also grip it like this, you guys. Or you could put your fingers in there. I just wish they had a drainage hole or, or, or something, but hey, it's all good. But you guys, if you see these, try these out. These are really, really good. Like I said, I'm going to go get more. And I hope you guys like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care.